My name is Tyler Matnick. I am the director of Hairspray here at Springfield High School. Hairspray takes place in late 1950s, early 1960s, uh, and we're in Baltimore, so there's still definitely segregation in the workplace, so there's big issues about that throughout the show, and it's just so powerful how things change during that time period, and it's so great to tell that story. This show is definitely an uncomfortable topic for people to discuss because it is so recent. Like, Segregation and uh, racism is still a big thing in our community, so it's really nice to like have an audience come and see like how hard it was to work when white and black people couldn't be together on stage or in a workplace. And this definitely makes people feel uncomfortable, and it's supposed to. It's supposed to make them have that feeling, so they know like what's right, what's wrong. And it's really cool showing the, the good side of this argument. I am an alumni, so I graduated back in 2012 and I went off and got a degree in musical theater and acting and directing. Being back is really interesting. There's actually someone in the cast that was a elementary student when I did a high school show here and they were in the show with me. So it's kind of it's kind of funny. Working with all these talented kids, is, it's been a pleasure. It's definitely weird seeing the stage that I performed on a lot and not actually being on it with them. And it's seeing all the traditions that I used to do still kind of be around is a really cool experience. There's so much talent on stage here, especially with this cast. There's so many, there's over 60 different characters. And uh, they're all my best friends. Um, girl who plays Penny, I've been acting with since freshman year. So I really, I really enjoyed it. Oh my God, it's a dream of a lifetime. I have to go audition. Oh my God, it's a dream of a lifetime. I have to go watch you audition. <laughs> that would be enough of that. There will be no auditioning for anything. No one is cutting school in this house. But, Mrs. Turnblad? Penny, go tell your mother that she needs you. Oh, she does? Mm -hmm. I better go. Bye, Tracy! Bye, Mrs. Turnblad! This is my first time working with Tyler, and he's been a joy to work with. I really like how he brought the play to life in like a different way that I never saw Hairspray before. And I really like how he portrays each character and how he wants us to do it. It's really cool. I really enjoyed working with him. He's really easygoing, and uh, it was really nice to have to work with like a different directing style and um, to work with someone who knows what you're going through and has been through it um, multiple times. Definitely, they all have been used to directing from Corey, who has a different directing style as me. So, like when you change something, it doesn't always go as smoothly or well. So, like getting them acclimated with how I direct. It has been a challenge, Just they just have to get used to it. The first couple times if I told them to do something this way, they're like, well, I'm not used to doing that, or it's always been done like this, and I'm just like, well, we're doing it like this now. So like, you have to face that challenge. But other than that, it's been, up until this week, it's been a challenge, but they're, they finally are getting it, and it's, it looks really great. I want the audience to feel that you can be anyone you want, and you can feel comfortable in your own skin, no matter what race or what size you are. I feel like you can relate the struggles in this place nowadays, like even with Tracy like being overweight, you know, it's okay to be different even with the racing, like you should be comfortable in your own skin and in your own weight. I want them to feel like they can be themselves and that it can be, we're all together in this world and we don't need to be against each other in any way. I want the audience to come here and um, enjoy the show obviously. It's funny, there's a lot of comedy, it's upbeat, there's a lot of song, but I also want them to see the interesting topics and the uncomfortable topics that people usually don't talk about and leave the place like, wow, maybe I shouldn't have been like that in the past or have a better attitude for it. Oh!